and on Tom Edwards' note about not picking people based on politics, well, discrimination is, is picking anyone based on a certain characteristic, whether that's race or politics. And we've just listened to a workshop of you all talking about how we need to hire people based on their complexion. So again, another double standard. It doesn't really mesh with what you're saying. Um, you've called all Trump supporters Nazis. Um, and then we have someone going on and not Let's making a political comment. Let's try not to comment. make personal comments about Well, I listened to members. you make personal comments and shame one of our board members the, in the workshop today, which... B board she, members were discussing talking to each other. I thought this wasn't supposed to be a back and forth. Um, I'm, I'm, okay. Our free speech is under attack. We have every right to sit here and, and share our opinions. I'm not being rude. I'm just stating facts, okay? It's not adding up for us. Um, I know that there was some talk about comments that I made on Facebook about five years ago. And I'll say it again. I regret them, and they were a mistake. Now, I will tell you that I use it as a teaching moment for our young people, because guess what? When you're angry and you don't like what happened and you, your president didn't get elected and you put something up on Facebook, it comes back to haunt you. And so when I get to Florida, instead of complaining about it, I'm going to do something about it. And guess what? I ran for office and I got elected. So when you're unhappy, you can do something about it. And so I'm pretty proud of that, quite honestly. And so I'm here. It's that Dr. Asplund and I have partnered to work together. And it's important that as Democrats that are all sitting here that you can take some victory laps of the type of work that's being done at the school board and, and some of it uh, through work that, that I've actually done. Imagine. <laughs> Most disappointed because I think uh, as a board uh, we've worked uh, genuinely very hard to uh, speak uh, at, at collectively and to not be divided and not to let politics find its way here. Uh, I know I have uh, worked hard on a personal level to keep politics out. And from the very first time I met Dr. Kingsley, she said, politics does not belong in education. I remember that at our our first meeting, and, and I took that to heart before I declared running. But I'll share with you uh, a quote from our governor, which disturbs me greatly. We're not going to support any Republican candidate for school board who supports critical race theory. And I'm under the impression that it's a nonpartisan race. And was yes. I mean, that when you get right down to it, you're going to have to look at my record and my, my, how I comport myself as a professional school board member.